Hello, everybody. So, I have a mega box of 2021 Tops Gallery. So, this I went by Walmart. Um, I hadn't been there in over a month because I haven't been card shopping. I had an accident at work. Um, I just got home, back to my house for the first time in a month. Um, I think the accident happened on December 15th. So, I went from having like two to three videos a week to having absolutely none for a month. So, that's what's been going on with me. I had an accident where I fell off a ladder at work. I broke the bone, my pelvis. Uh, basically, couldn't walk, couldn't put weight on my legs, couldn't even walk with crutches until this week. So, very grateful to be back up and moving around. Saw this box at Walmart. They were 80 bucks. So, that's a pretty steep price hike, but it does come with two autos per box. Um, so, I went online. I had watched a few videos because this product came out about a, a few weeks ago or about a month ago, sometime around when the accident happened. And I saw a video from, let's see here, it's called Everybody's or Everyone's Favorite Dunkle. So, Uncle, but it's got a D in front of it. I actually wrote it down to give him a shout out. He's got 120 subs. You guys should go check him out. Anybody who watches this video, make sure to go check out that video because he pulled some heaters out of this exact same product so same thing mega box this is a walmart exclusive um i also picked up from the fred myers here in the pacific northwest just some random couple hanger boxes of update um and a single pack because that's all they had left and uh, normally i pick up at least five things from fred myers when they do have stuff but they only had three left so at least we got some hangers because you already know that's my favorite product so excited to see what gets into this here um there is all kinds of stuff on the checklist i always print out like a little sheet uh when i'm doing a new product so that way i know when i pull something you know what the short prints are i think there's only 10 short printed players i did go on there and look and i do have the list of them here so as we get going here i will make sure if we pull any of those players to check to see if they are image variations but they are very very rare um, I think it's like one short print image variation per 600 packs or something I don't really remember uh, the odds are on the side of the box if we pull anything really cool we will check it out and see Let's set these off to the side here we got some of my favorite cards in the background here Hopefully going to get some luck. Hopefully one of our two autos is a good one. Uh, for what I've seen on average, people have pulled three to five numbered parallels per box. So I know that these are very, very cool looking cards. There are 20 packs with five cards in each pack. So I am going to do a super rip style here, two packs at a time, because there's only five cards per pack and these are these foil packs i'm trying not to damage these cards here now tops gallery in years past has always had art photos so the art has actually been artist illustrations this year the base cards are photos um which online it says they're artist renditions but i can tell you right now that's a photo so very first card Happy with that. That's a Dylan Carlson rookie card there. Then we got a horizontal Fernando Tatis Jr. We have this list here of short prints. He is on the short print player list, so we'll put him off to the side and we'll check that after. There is a modern artist. That's one of the inserts, and that is an artist illustration there. Chris Bryant for the Cubs. Put that with inserts. We've got Kevin Gosman. Jesus Sanchez rookie card there. Good old Mike Piazza. We got Miguel Conforto. And these are beautiful cards. So our first we're gonna have a rainbow foil, which these are not numbered. Ricky Henderson, it's a nice 
rainbow foil tops, you know, card like always. And then we got the Matt Olson and Casey Mize rookie. Hope for hopefully all you guys are doing well out there. It's been a bummer not being able to really do anything and just I mean, man, it was hurting to sit, it was hurting to walk. I mean, I couldn't do anything, man. I literally was just laying on my mom's couch for three and a half weeks. Um, I did get to spend a lot of time with my kids, which was a blessing in disguise. So back at it now. We got Key Brian Hayes, rookie card. That's a good one. Ronald Acuna Jr. And he is also on the short print list. So we'll put him off to the side there. And there's our first autograph. Jose Barrio, rookie card, auto. And what kind of scribble is that? At least the card's centered well. I will take it. The boxes, I watched about 10 of these boxes get opened. On For what I saw, every other auto was numbered. Um... I only saw two decent rookie autos get pulled. One was a Carlson and an India, but neither were numbered. Um, so, yeah, we'll see how this goes. I just want to pull some low-numbered cards or something really cool. I saw one-of-ones, all kinds of stuff. But you guys should definitely go check out that video I gave a shout-out to. Brandon Lowe. Got Spencer Howard, rookie. Isaac Paredes, rookie. Hopefully I'll get my two redemptions of him soon. Mike Yastrzemski. There is a rainbow foil of Jackie Robinson. Ozzy Albies. And Logan Gilbert. Rookie card there. You know, for an $80 retail box... You know, you get 20 packs and two autos, so I mean, it pretty much is a hobby box, but man, it's got to deliver for that price. You can't just get a bunch of base cards, which is what's been happening to me lately. I have not had much luck, so hopefully that can change and we can pull some good stuff. I spent about 100 bucks on these update and this, so we'll see what happens if I can pull something to recoup some of that. We got Mark Canna. There's a Jake Cronenworth, another horizontal. There is the Next Wave, which is in one of the inserts, which I'm just a fan of Bo, so that will go in my Bo collection there. There are autograph versions and numbered parallel versions of all the inserts, so that's why I check those. We got Randy Arozarena. Christian Pache, rookie. Looking all swagged out. There's the uh, Jonathan India, rookie. Definitely getting all the top players' base rookies. Um, it would be nice to hit something better, though. There's Ian Anderson, rookie. Julio Urias. And a Sam Huff, rookie. A lot of people were high on him before the season started. So we'll see how he comes out. He's kind of disappeared in the shadows of names from this year. So see if he can bounce back and regain some of that hype. And see if we can start getting some numbered cards, because that's what we need. There are numbered cards that are colored parallels, and then there are textured colored parallels or patterned colored parallels i think is what it said online so eloy and then there's some kind of uh, insert the originals and they look like they have creases and stains on them and stuff but there's a nate pearson rookie another rainbow foil walker bueller nothing numbered yet see this has been my luck recently hopefully this can change john carlos stanton Ozzy Smith. We got Bo Bichette. David Ortiz. And there's something behind here. What is this? 
a green, Mike Yastrzemski, and I think this is what it means by the colored pattern. So there's a green, but then there's a green with a pattern, and this is the green with the pattern. So this should be lower number than the regular green. And this one's out of 99. It's number 9 of 99, Mike Yastrzemski. Definitely not the parallel we're looking for, but there is a Francisco Lindor. and a Mariano Rivera. Last two packs in the first stack, and then we get into the second half of the box. I'm gonna try to go a little quicker here. Hopefully we're gonna get some numbered cards coming soon. It looks like we just pulled all the rainbow foils at the beginning of the box. For the boxes I've seen, I mean, there were a lot of rainbow foils, a few inserts, but for the most part, the numbered cards were kind of scattered around. Um, not in my case. Anthony Rizzo. Ernie Banks. Winker. Albert Pujols. Is he going to play again? I haven't really been following that. I thought maybe this was his last year, but... David Wright. Derek Jeter, the captain. Uh, let's see here. We got Andrew Benatini. Oh, there's one of the MLB originals. Non-numbered. So, like I said, there are parallel and autographs of all these. Well, since he is for my Mariners and one of my all-time favorites, the good old Ichiro, I'll put a sleeve on him. Put him in the insert pile. Altuve and Kirby Puckett. Hopefully, this is going to heat up a little bit here because Jose Birio and Mike Yastrzemski, Otto and Parallel, are not going to get it done for that $80 price tag. You know, what is going on here? Man, some of these packs have not been easy to open. All right. Something stuck on my finger. Andrew Vaughn. Bryce Harper, he is on the short print list, so we'll put him in that pile to check later. Oh, okay. Well, there's our second auto. Mickey Moniak. Too bad it's not numbered. So neither auto is numbered. Both base sticker rookie autos. Not what I wanted there, but, I mean... Both are positional players. I did not get a pitcher, which is nice. Outfielder and shortstop, so could have been worse. Hopefully we get at least a good parallel to even us out here. Javi Baez. So all, oh, Hank Aaron. I'll name off the 10 players um, who have image variations. So we got Mookie Betts. Mike Trout, Ronald Acuna Jr., Shohei, Aaron Judge, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Bryce Harper, Pete Alonzo, Juan Soto, Fernando Tatis. So basically just the big, big guys. King Griffey Jr., Byron Buxton. There is a Jose Abreu rainbow foil. Miguel Cabrera and Manny Ramirez. Tons of base cards so far. I mean, those two autos were not the greatest. I've had a lot of Mickey Moniac parallels, so um, and rookies, and all these packs and boxes and packs and boxes I've opened over the year. So I might have to go through and dig some of those out because he was not a guy that I've been pulling out. There's an Alec Baum. Rookie, Trey Turner, another rainbow foil, Robin Yount. Tons of rainbow foils, I feel like every pack, every other pack. We got JT Ralmuto, Tariq Scooball, rookie, Brady Singer, rookie. A lot of people are really thinking he's going to be something special. Nolan Arenado, what do we got here? Master of the Craft. Paul Goldschmidt. Okay. 
John Means, and Nick Madrigal. So, so far so not good, guys. I've gotten one numbered card, and it was that Mike Yastrzemski, and it was to 99. That, man, I'm telling you, if this box doesn't hype up big time, you guys really need to go watch that box from uh, everyone's favorite Dunkle, because Jesus Christ. I straight up just went to Walmart because of that box I watched him open and spent 80 bucks on this, so I'll be kind of disappointed if it just flops big time after that because, man, he pulled amazing stuff in there. He must have just had a super hot box, but Braylon Marquez, rookie. Andrew McCutcheon. Okay. Deion Sanders, non-numbered rainbow foil. Joey Bart, rookie. I think Dion was the number one card in the set. Yep. I looked on the checklist before this. Jordan. Taylor Trammell, rookie. Glaber Torres. My boy, Mitch Hanniger. Alex Kirilov, rookie. So basically, we've pulled a base rookie of every good rookie so far. But we have not... <laughs> I mean, unless there's two numbered cards in this last section here... What is going on with the bottom of these packs? Did they? It's like it won't open that way. So I don't know if they overcrimped them or what, but I was going to say the only rookie that we haven't pulled yet is a Joe Adele, and I think that's the top card there, but... All right. We better hit, like, two numbered cards bam bam here, because if I get just all rainbow foils, I'm going to be butthurt. Stan, the man, Muse, though. Jacob deGrom. Modern Artists, non-numbered parallel there. There is a Mike Trout. He is also on that short print list. Same with Juan Soto. Joe Adele, rookie. Pete Alonzo, also on the short print list. John Means. I mean, I wouldn't mind if we hit a short print of one of these guys because they're all big names. Austin Meadows. And Ko Arihara rookie. Because they're all big names and the short prints are pretty rare. Last two packs, guys. Hopefully there's a numbered card in each of these packs because we've only hit one. That would be the worst box I've seen on YouTube. Every box I've seen has had at least three numbered cards. So... We'll see what happens here, but looking on the box, the rainbow foil is one and three. We've been getting one every other. Private issue, one and 16. Green is one and 68. Green pattern, that's what we got. The green pattern is one and 85. Not, it's pretty much the second worst parallel you can get. We got. Gallery of Heroes, Modern Artists, Green. So, yeah, every parallel you can get numbered ones. I was looking for short prints. Huh. The short print. Oh, one in 672 packs. It was on my printed sheet there. Well, so that would not be bad if we could pull one of those, but... So, Robin Yount, last two packs, guys. Let's hope. Give me some juju here. Ted Williams. Will Clark. Corbin Burns. I mean, this product, I am getting six times as many base veteran cards as I am anything else here. We got Ricky Henderson. Walker Bueller. Did that pack not even have an insert? It didn't have anything. It was just all base cards in that pack. Walker Bueller and... Wow, guys. Akil Badu, the bad man, Buster Posey, and Trevor Story. Wow. We got one numbered card. Man, I'm telling you, I've watched like 10 boxes get opened. Every single box that I saw get opened, every single one, guys, had at least three. Some of them had five or six numbered cards in there. My box 
had literally one numbered parallel. This has been my luck lately. I've had streaks where I've gotten just crazy hot. And then I've had streaks where I'm just cold as ice. And I'm telling you, I've been cold, cold, cold lately. Bad luck all the way around. Injuries, bad boxes. So we'll see here. I mean, it is possible with the new design I missed something. But I'm going to triple check that right now. Because I'm telling you guys, for 80 bucks, I like to do these as kind of reviews also and give you my honest opinion of products. I mean, the ones that I really, really like, I tell you I really, really like. And the ones that I buy, and I'm like, what the heck is this? I also tell you about that too. So, let's see here. Yet. Oh, the John Means was numbered. See? That was a green. See how that easy that was to miss? So that one's to 125. But we didn't get a single numbered rainbow foil rookie i mean we didn't get a rainbow foil rookie we didn't get nothing no good rookies other than base cards so the code is 90 let's check these star cards here to make sure 90 90 90 90 90 and 90 so we did get almost one, two, three, four, five, six. We got six of the ten players that have short prints, but none of them are. So you guys tell me two greens, numbered parallels. That's the least amount of numbered cards I've seen out of any of the boxes that I've seen get opened. And then a Jose Birio rookie and a Mickey Moniac rookie auto. So not the greatest box, guys. Probably the worst one I've seen open, but... Um, you know, that's how it goes sometimes. Sometimes you get hot, sometimes you get cold. So, they get lots of good base rookies, but in years past, these have not hold great value, especially with the amount of cards they're printing this year. So, thank you guys for watching. I will upload this video, and then I will rip these two in my next video with that extra pack I found. So, thank you guys. Some tops update coming back at you soon. That product has definitely treated us good this year, so... Thank you guys for watching. I will catch you guys in the next one. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching. Show off my background cards real quick. That is a Jordan Westberg out of 10 patch auto. Out of 25, Cedric Mullins, RPA. Marco Luciano, RPA out of 50. Of course, the good old Bo Show out of 50 gold on card. That is an Adley Rutschman. 2019 auto it is also like a cool refractor but that's numbered out of 25 uh, the two vladdies the pink and the purple hot box refractors and the vladdy one of one game use from series 2 2020 start switching it up after this with those but thank you guys for watching catch you in the next one peace